I haven't sold a single copy of my autobiography. The story of my life. Oh, whoa, whoa, I ain't got no dad bod. Got a father figure. We've all seen it before. People do them slip and falls. Go into the grocery store. They look for a wet spot. Or they have an accomplice put a wet spot down they can slip in. I mean, it's it's the same thing. You're just going in with a video camera. You 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 literally recorded your intentions. We got somebody coming in. I'll stand right here. Seven. And as far as comprehension goes, you have been awarded a two. Thank you for playing. Have a nice day. You really wanted to break it down to its smaller parts. What I'm saying is, you 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 you, you could have prevented all this. You, you, I saw the sign. And you wonder why we call them dumb. They're able to read the thing just like we are. It's funny how you and I can read it and draw a completely different conclusion from an idiot. How you doing? Yes, I will be. I'll be up there in one second. Is the postmaster in today? I'm OIC. You're what? I'm sorry. I'm not, I'm not familiar with that. What is that? Officer in charge. Officer in charge. All right. What was your name? Sherry. Sherry. Nice to meet you, Sherry. Nice. My name's Johnny. Uh, how much? Sherry is a very polite person. Johnny, if it is his name, not so much. We're going to move ahead a little bit. How you doing? Hey, how you doing? You got to give permission to take pictures of me, man. Well, certainly didn't take you long to become unliked. Kind of like having crap on the bottom of your shoe, you know? Smells really bad. It won't just go away. It's difficult to deal with, and it don't belong in here. No, I don't. Hey, what's wrong with this crazy guy in here? I have no idea. You can't be doing that. I don't know what he's doing. You just can't be telling people without letting them know what he's doing. I know that. Uh, okay. I, got, I got rights too. You just can't be right now is where you should have just kept your mouth shut. And you probably could have wrote this whole thing out. But you're full of yourself. And you, you think what you're doing is actually something. You, you're just a pineapple with a cell phone. You feel me, buddy? No, I can't, though. No. I know you can't. You know that. 
Let me get out of town before I flip. Yeah, I know what you can and can't do. Oh, apparently not. Apparently, I know you can't be filming me without me knowing. Oh, you know now. Can. Yes, I can. No, you can't. Okay. Walking here cause a disturbance to call me a crazy guy. He's here to use the services. You walked in here to be a disturbance. You are standing in the corner with a cell phone, hoping and praying that this would happen. What disturbance I got? Hmm? What disturbance I got? Hey, you're causing, you're coming in here raising your voice. You, Over voice. a phone. It's my voice. Yeah. But you can't be just feminine. No, absolutely I can. Absolutely I can. Yeah, please. That's the problem with y'all now. What do you mean y'all? Yeah, right. Oh, you people. Idiots with cell phones. Jobless. Bums. You know, the unemployable. See, I got right to freedom of speech. I can say what I want to say. Exactly. Well, this is part of it. You're referring to the First Amendment, I know. Oh boy, Sherry. This is going a lot better in the beginning. You gotta let people know what you No, doing. I don't. Okay. Okay. I guarantee you do in this post. No, nope, I guarantee you I don't. Okay. If Proverbs 16, 18. Pride goeth before destruction and a haughty spirit before a fall. I'm saying that because it's, it, it absolutely applies right now. If you'd like, you can stick around for a free education. Maybe the cops are coming. I don't, I don't need know. No education from you. Oh, it's not going to be for me. It'll be from the cops that come. Yeah. I don't need no education from you. Maybe, uh, maybe you didn't hear me. I said it will be the. You, maybe you didn't hear me. What I said. Yeah. What'd you say? Why are you talking to me? <laughs> yeah, you the smart one. You? Yeah, I know, and you seem to be the dumb one. Okay, it's happening. Everybody, stay calm. What's, What's the procedure, procedure everyone? everyone? What's the procedure? Stay calm. Call me dumb again. Call me dumb again. Call me dumb again. And the last, ladies and gentlemen, you get to witness his true colors. All they want to do is cause a problem. They don't actually want a problem. Just want to run their mouth a good bit. Record it. Say, ha ha, look at me. Children. You know, it's funny to me. You had so much to say, so much going on. Now, just crickets. That's all I hear is crickets. What, what happened to all that bravado and all that tough stuff? What, where did that go? Well, this started off a lot better, guys. We are about to have a very nice cordial conversation with Sherry. But uh, now this has turned to a different situation. Oh, really? As you guys know, these things change quick, so. Why do you do it then? Be careful, I wouldn't take your phone out. This guy's gonna get in your face. This guy. I wouldn't take your phone out. I wouldn't do it. Keep being smart, and you're going to get what to come and tell you. Guaranteed. Okay. Guaranteed. Okay. Sounds good. You know what? I'm going to agree with you. It certainly does sound good. It sounds like something that we would all enjoy. I might even pay a couple bucks just to watch it. There we go. That was quick. How you doing? Some people don't know me. 
Doesn't know if it's against the law or not, but she figured she'd call the police. But the biggest problem is the post offices need to sit down and tell me, hey, someone comes in here recording, do you see what it says here? You are personnel. You can tell this idiot to leave. If he doesn't want to leave, get, get a hold of law enforcement, get him trespassed as soon as possible. The policy of the post office, you know, and you want him gone, and then you can ask him to leave. Really? You have asked him to leave. Do you have any legitimate business? Are you, are you transacting? I do have legitimate business here. Okay. I already did transact, yes. Okay, so now you're loitering. No. Boom. Roast it. Yeah. No. No, nope, I'm here. I'm here collecting information for a story. And no, no, absolutely not. There is no part of any of you journalists. Okay, all you guys are are harassers. You know, disruptors. You know, d d bottom feeders. You know, you, you, you know, journalists. No, no. No. You guys will not see me anymore. This video. I'm going to let it play out. This is all for you guys. Special thank you to all of my members. All those who like my video. Thank you for subscribing. Sharing. It all matters. Thank you. And yes, I'm going to start trimming it up soon. I'm just letting it all grow out before I start doing it. I want to do it right this time. And to disseminate it to the public. Okay, well, that's fine. But you got, you got to do it outside. No, I don't. So... Ma'am, have you asked him to leave yet? I asked him if he had any other business. He said no. Okay. So, so if you don't want him here, you need to ask him to leave. Can you leave, sir? Now I'm going to ask you a question. Do you think? Do you do you seriously believe the words that are coming out of your mouth right now? But yeah, that's that's why I said it. All right, she's already asked you to leave. She's an employee of the post office. No, no, no. The box the box for the answer is about this big. That answer was about that big. It's a okay, yes or so no. Let me, let me put it to you Do you believe way. the words that are coming you out of your mouth leave. right now? Uh huh. If you don't leave, it's trespass after notice. You're going to jail. Really? Yeah. And what's the what's the first crime? What's the primary crime? She just told you to leave. No. What's the primary crime? Sorry. Stop trespass. No. The primary crime. You don't think, and that's your problem. All right. So here's the deal. That's a secondary offense. You've that's got a secondary five offense. Five seconds to leave. I want going to jail. Okay. I, before you speak another word, no, I want you no, to call your supervisor. No. Before you speak another, I'm the chief. The, so now, you're the chief. Yes. You're you the need chief. To leave. Okay. Well, you call so, call somebody leave. else. You better. No, 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 son. No, no. Telling the chief to call somebody else. Now, now, now. That that is a bad idea. What? He says it's a bad idea. You better call somebody else. Call a Five, judge. Call a judge. Four, three, two. <laughs> <laughs> One, you're under arrest. Anything you do other than what I tell you will be considered resisting arrest. Do you understand? No, you not not that? really. I want okay. you to call your supervisor. Okay. I want you to call your supervisor. That's fine. You're under arrest. Go ahead and sit this down because I don't want to break it. Hands behind your back. There you go. Are you going to call your supervisor? Hello? You got some idea on you? No, I don't. Alright. Please don't stop the recording.